Ugh, ugh. What's going on? This pain is unreal. Ugh, somebody help me. Oh my gosh, what's wrong, Mr. Hungry? I'm not sure, but my stomach hurts a lot. I can't even describe this pain. Ow. Hmm, not sure what's going on, but you came to the right place. Can you lay down for me? I'll take a closer look. Okay, Mr. Hungry, I'm going to start by checking your vitals. Okay, your vitals seem fine. Unfortunately, can't really tell what's wrong from the outside, so we're gonna have to put you to sleep and open your stomach to get a better look. Don't worry though, you'll be okay. Alright, Mr. Hungry is fast asleep. Let the surgery begin. Got a nice clean cut. Now let's open his stomach. What in the world? What am I looking at right now? My goodness, no wonder his stomach was hurting. There are things in here that shouldn't be in here. Seriously though, what's he been eating? Look at this. He has a green frog inside of his stomach. Ugh, this is even more gross. Check out this green earthworm. It's not even pink or anything, it's green. Ugh, it's getting worse. Oh my gosh. For some reason, he must have thought this green bug was delicious. He literally ate three of these green bugs. That is something. I'm scared, but what else is in here? Wow, he ate a blue screw? This explains a lot. This one must have hurt. Mm, fish is pretty normal, but I'm taking a closer look at these blue fish, and they do not look normal. This is definitely sewer fish, if that's even a thing. But most likely, these fish were rotten when he consumed. Let's see what else. Pink is a pretty color, and butterflies are pretty too, but I don't think you can eat them. Oh, Mr. Hungry. What's up with Mr. Hungry and bugs? Where is he hanging out? He has another earthworm in his stomach. Well, this one's pink, so I guess it's fresh? Oh my gosh, is this a giant worm or a snake? Oops, never mind. This is his large pink intestine. Pretty important, so let's put it back. Uh-oh, did he break a bone? Nope, this is a white wishbone. No idea where he got this, but this must have hurt a lot too. Yikes, he also has a white tooth inside his stomach. This is very disgusting. Oh, I knew this was going to happen. He has this nasty yellow bacteria growing inside his stomach. Oh, is this bacteria too? Nope, this is actually a small yellow intestine. He definitely needs this to absorb all the nutrients from the foods he eats. Although, not quite sure what kind of nutrients he's getting. Wow. The first normal thing we're actually seeing. It's ham. What's not normal? He inhaled this giant red ham. Didn't even slice it up. Please don't tell me. Say it ain't so. Whew. This red heart is his. Thought he ate someone else's heart. We would have had problems then. Let's put this back. Look how unhappy his stomach is. Don't worry. We're cleaning everything out, so you should feel better soon. Okay, this is probably the most disgusting and disturbing thing. He ate a brown toe. I have no words, and I may need to sit down and talk with him about this one. Woo! That was a lot of junk. We cleaned everything out of his stomach. Now let's wrap things up. This will only take a minute. Alright, he needs some stitches. Perfect. Now we wait for Mr. Hungry to wake up. Wow, my stomach doesn't hurt anymore. I feel super light, and overall I feel great. Uh, yeah. Do you see what's in front of you? No wonder your stomach was in pain. Also, what's up with the toe? I have so many questions. Uh, I'm not sure. I usually eat anything I see when I get hungry, so that's probably why I had all these weird items inside of me. 
Mm, I have no idea where you've been, but, but if you're seeing a t s o w maybe don't walk around there anymore. Also, maybe just don't eat stuff like this anymore. Eating junk like this will really ruin you. It's a good thing we caught this early. Then what should I be eating? I don't know any of this. I thought everything was okay to eat. Can you feed me what I should be eating? I'm really hungry after that surgery, actually. Oh wow, I guess no one taught you, huh? Yeah, sure thing. I'll get that ready for you right now. Alright, Mr. Hungry. Don't want to stuff you with heavy foods after that surgery, so I'll feed you fruits and vegetables today. Here, start by trying this orange carrot. This will improve your eyesight and you won't mistake junk for food. Aww. Oh wow, that carrot was super crunchy. I love the texture. Now I know you love sweets, but eating them often is not good for you. Try this red strawberry instead. Won't be as sweet, but fruits are a better substitute. Aww. Oh wow, that's what a fruit tastes like? Sign me up, that tasted like candy. Your body has also taken a lot of damage, so you can use all the vegetables you can get. Try this green broccoli. Aww. Whoa, I feel like my body is healing already. It's definitely a new taste for me, but I feel very clean. Well, that's because you were eating junk before. Last but not least, try this red tomato. It's actually used in foods you love, like pizza and pasta. Aww. Wow, compared to pizza and pasta, way more juicy and fresh. So this is what a tomato tastes like. I like it. Yep, don't be afraid to try different fruits and veggies. All of them provide different nutrients for you, and your body will heal in no time. Since you've been really good about this, I'll give you some dessert. Enjoy this mint chocolate chip on a chocolate cone. Wait, really? I can eat this ice cream? This looks delicious. I guess it pays to eat healthy. Ah. Wow, eating healthy foods makes the ice cream taste so much better. I also feel better too. Thanks for correcting my bad habit. I won't go eating everything and anything anymore. No problem, that's what I'm here for. Just don't let me open your stomach again, okay? Hey, long time no see. I'm really hungry, and the first person I thought of was you. Do you have any food for me? Hey, Mr. Hungry, long time. I do have some food, but it looks like you already ate some food. Are you sure you're hungry? What do you mean? My stomach is growling, so yeah, I am hungry. Can you open your mouth for me? Let me show you something. Aww, look at all of these food stains. And you're telling me you didn't eat already? Or wait, when's the last time you brushed your teeth? Um, I don't really remember the last time I brushed my teeth. I don't brush my teeth that often. Haha. <laughs> oh boy, I'm so glad I caught this. Mr. Hungry, that is not healthy for you. I'll teach you how to take care of your teeth. Oh, I didn't know it was that bad, but no one ever taught me, so I really didn't know. I'm so glad I have you. I can't wait to learn. Okay, let's get started. We're going to do some flossing. You want to glide your floss between your teeth using a gentle motion. Doing this will get rid of any food that gets stuck in between teeth. You know, Mr. Hungry, a lot of people think they only need to brush their teeth. But that's not the case. Your toothbrush bristles might not be able to get in between the tight spots, and left unchecked, it will damage your teeth over time. Flossing can be pretty annoying and a hassle, but just know you're saving yourself a lot of trips to the dentist in the future by doing this. Alright, give me a minute while I finish flossing. Okay, we got all the gunk out in between your teeth. It was quite a lot, so your teeth must feel much better already. Now we just have to brush your teeth, and you'll be good as new. Start by adding some toothpaste. Now just do a gentle motion all around your teeth. If you're wondering how long, just turn on your favorite song, and once the song is finished, you can stop brushing. You want to brush your teeth twice a day, and you'll be able to remove food and plaque that builds up after you eat. Also, you'll prevent cavities and gum diseases as well. This is also very important. There's a lot of bacteria on your tongue that can cause bad breath, so brush your tongue thoroughly, and you'll have fresh breath throughout the day. Almost finished!
Awesome! Look, Mr. Hungry, your teeth look brand new. By the way, what did you eat that left so much gunk on your teeth? Uh, I usually eat whatever I'm in the mood for when I get hungry. Let's see, the last meal I had was a bunch of ice cream. Mmm, I have a feeling you have ice cream a lot. You know, that's really bad for your teeth because of all that sugar. It's fine to have once in a while, but make sure you eat healthier foods moving forward. I'm not familiar with healthy foods. Can you show me what I should be eating more of? Of course! Check it out, Mr. Hungry. I brought some vegetables for you. I know, I know. It may not sound delicious, but they are really good for your body, and you should be eating about 2-3 to three cups of veggies a day. Wow, 2-3 to three cups? I rarely eat vegetables. Can you teach me more about these vegetables? Of course, I'll teach you about all the vegetables I brought today. Oh, I'm very excited now. I can't wait to learn about and try all these vegetables. Okay, let's get started. This purple vegetable is called an eggplant, Mr. Hungry. I know you love sugar, so eggplants are actually pretty crucial for you. They do a better job of processing sugar, so it helps promote blood sugar control. Here you go. Ah. Oh, it's kind of better, but not bad at all. Texture-wise, it's firm and spongy. Overall, it's kind of bland, so I would mix this in with a dish that has bold flavors. What's next? Alright, I didn't know you were such a chef. Okay, next. Not sure if you're good with spicy, but try this red chili. If you get sick easily, vitamin C can help with that. And red chilies are jam-packed with them. Give it a try. Ah. It has a little bit of a kick, but it's very earthy and smoky. Very dry too, but I like the crunchy texture. This would add great flavor to any dish. I'm ready for more. Alright, now let's try this carrot. Probably one of the easier vegetables to eat. Really good for your eyes too, so give it a try and let me know what you think. I'm sure you want to see all the ice cream in the world, right? Ah. Uh... Wow! I love this texture even more than the chili. It's so crunchy. I also like the taste. Kind of sweet and earthy. Veggies are good. I want more. Glad you're liking them. Okay, not sure what you'll think about this, but try this radish. If you keep eating the way you do, you're going to have high blood pressure and heart problems. Eating radish can help reduce both of those problems. Ah. Oh, it's very crisp. Slightly bitter, but certain parts are sweet too. It's crunchy like a carrot, but I think I like the carrot taste better. What's next? Alright, I got one more vegetable for you. If you're ever feeling dehydrated on a hot day, add cucumbers to your diet. Cucumbers help promote hydration. Give it a try. Ah. Uh... Wow, that was very hydrating. It has a very fresh taste, and it reminds me of summer. All of the vegetables were amazing. I can't wait to try them with other foods. I'm glad you're going to add vegetables into your diet now. Since you ate all the vegetables and enjoyed them, I'll give you an ice cream cone as a final treat. Oh wow, really? But didn't we just talk about how bad ice cream was for my teeth? Mm-hmm, it still is. But you ate a lot of veggies, and I have a feeling you'll cut down on the sweets, so you can have dessert today. Okay, here's a mint chocolate chip ice cream. Aww. The ice cream was delicious. It actually tasted better today. Maybe because it was a well-deserved treat after eating all those healthy foods. Thanks for letting me eat my favorite food again. No problem. Okay, Mr. Hungry, do you know what you have to do next? I need to brush my teeth right now. Yep, that's right. Let's go clean your teeth. Okay, let's start by brushing your teeth. Make sure we get the tongue. Alright. Remember what I said, brushing is only the first step. The second step is just as important, and that's flossing. We have to get rid of all the food particles that's in between. 
give me a minute. Okay, Mr. Hungry, your teeth are sparkling clean now, and your breath is super fresh. Super fresh indeed. I honestly feel so much better now. Before, I always felt something off about my teeth, but I didn't really care. Thanks for letting me know. Remember to maintain a healthy diet too, okay? No more sweets every day. I'm sure you'll do better moving forward. Yup, I'll eat my vegetables, and I'll brush my teeth twice a day. No more food stuck in my teeth. That's the spirit. Awesomer Pop fans! Thank you so much for watching. We can't do this without you. If you're new to the channel and became a fan, click that subscribe button for more awesome stuff. And if you want to be the first person to watch our next video, hit that notification bell to have a chance. See ya!